zebra is. See their pronghorns. And here's some more. So I guess they move them around a bit. More peninsula pronghorns are over here. Got the California rams over here. They're usually up here on the mountain. But I don't, I don't see any rams at the moment. So I'm trying to figure out if they move them or something. I don't know. Got the lowland Anoa right there. It kind of looks like a cow, doesn't it? Just a little bit. We got the babarusas or pig deers right over here. That's the meaning of babarusa. Referring to their antler like upper tusks. That building over there is the Wilson Harding Golf Course. So we're right next to the golf course over here in Griffith Park. All right, we got the ibis in here. We have, whoa, hello. He's like, oh, he's here, time to get me on camera. That's the ibis, scarlet ibis right there. I just flew in there. And on the ground are the, no, that's not it. Uh, the black-eyed stilts, those guys right there. The sun bitterns and the the buffalo heads. I'm guessing the buffalo heads are. Oh, there's a buffalo head right there. It's kind of hidden, but it's right there. Oh, wait, that's not a buffalo. That's a stilt. Pretty bird too. Look at that. I don't see the roadrunner at the moment, but that's where the roadrunner is located. And it looks like. Ooh, there he goes. There's also another bird in here too with the Roadrunner. That's the, what is that called? A masked bobwhite quail. Ooh, there's a quail in here. That's cool. And here we got the Spex Gazelle. It's right over there by the side. So far, I only see one gazelle. Sorry, come here. Come here, mommy. It's right there. We got the peccaries over here. That's cool. Ooh. Got the adax in here. Look at you. That's cool. <laughs> Got another one over here. This is where the African dog is located. As you can see, no dog. That's what it looks like right there. I've done vlogs over here before, so. African painted dog right there. Wow, this area is still closed. How about that? Interesting. However, this is open. I mean, it's open to view, obviously. <laughs> Got the white cheeked Duracos in here. Oh. You can kind of see in there. It's focusing on the bars. It's right there on the branch. This 
just like the bird area basically right over here. We got the lap wings in here and the mouse birds. There's a lap wing right there. And the mouse birds are probably the ones flying around in here. Yeah. There they go. Just flying around having a good time. And here are the mouse birds. In this one we have a certain number of birds in here. We got the golden breasted starling, the spotted thick knee, white headed buffalo weaver, and the black headed weaver. Kind of hard to see in here, but they're in there. Oh, look at these hibiscus bushes. When they get full bloom, they look so pretty. Like, they got some flowers in them right now. And if you have, like, desert tortoises as pets, they love this stuff. They get this, like, candy. Down this trail, we got, once again, the gorillas over here on the left. And now over here on the right is going to be Australia. There we go. So this right here used to be the Tasmanian Devil Pen. But as you can see, it is still closed. It was always fun to see the Tasmanian Devils running around in here. Getting all their exercise, getting ready for the Olympics. But yeah, it is still closed, unfortunately. Wow, it's been a while since the Tasmanian Devils have been in here. But yeah, this is little guys. This is where the wallabies and the rhinoceros hornbills are located. Oh, there's a wallaby right there on the box. Right there. But the hornbills, they can be. Oh, there's a hornbill right up there. Right there. And boy, do they make an interesting noise when they bark. <laughs> Way up there. The double waddled cassowary. Right there. Taking a break. Taking a nap sounds like so we're gonna just let it take a little break. Here's the other one right there by the rocks. Now we're heading to dragons of Komodo. The Komodo dragons right over here. Oh, it's dark in here. Why goodness? Alright, so Oh, it's closed. Are you kidding me? Exhibit temporarily closed. Dang it! I was really looking forward to seeing the Komodo Dragon. Well, last time I saw it, I barely saw the back side of it, and it was just huge. Like, it was like the size of Godzilla. Oh, these guys are on the move. I don't think I've ever seen them walking around. I've always seen them sleeping. Well, at least he's still here. That's cool. Yeah, I see you. I see you. He's like, uh oh. <laughs> Hi, how are you? It's like, get my good side. Talk to my agent. <laughs> it's Prentice, right? Yeah, Prentice. Oh. Hopefully, your buddy, the Komodo Dragon, will be coming back, okay? We'll see. That's sad. Hope it didn't die. But this is where another area where the wallabies are located. Are it's right in here. Hours are 10 a.m. to 4:30 p.m. But since the zoo has reopened twice now, it's still closed off. So hopefully in the future we'll be able to see this open. This is if you guys have been watching my vlogs, one of my more recent zoo vlogs. This is where we saw. Not only the wallabies, but also the koalas. They used to be in here, but now they're outdoors. This is also where we saw the mechanical dinosaurs and a special, like, spider exhibit. That was pretty cool. Oh, I can't forget about these guys. The kookaburras. The kookaburras. How you doing? Good to see ya. Hello. They got a little bigger since I last saw them. 
It's a tad bit bigger, not not super big. Probably because of the winter. There's a wallaby right here. Hello. Oh, there's one right here too. So this is the koala pin. And there is actually a woman heavily camouflaged right there. It's kind of hard to see them, but there's a koala in there taking a nap right in there. I briefly saw it, but I, well, I lost where, where it was, but there is a koala right in there that's taking a break. Last but certainly at least here in Australia, we got the kangaroos. That's going to do it for part 5 of my special vlog trip here to Los Angeles Zoo in February 2021. If you liked the video, hit the thumbs up button. It is greatly appreciated. Be sure to check out my videos here on YouTube as well as my other channels. The Educational Series, the Design Video Series, and the Travel Town Series. You can find me on Instagram. The link is down below in the description of this video as well as my P.O. Box address. And by the way, if you haven't seen any of my zoo trips, check out the playlist link in the description box. Thank you so much for watching. And seeing as I say in Hollywood, so not in Hollywood, I'm actually at the Los Angeles Zoo. That, my friends, is a wrap. See you next time.